Today guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can hide your likes and reactions on Facebook, both on the desktop and on the mobile device. So if you get into this and you find it useful, make sure to hit that like button and let's get right into it. Okay, so here we are with facebook.com. If we go up to our avatar in the top right hand corner, give that a click, go down to where it says settings and privacy. From here, click on settings. That's gonna load up all the settings for Facebook over on the far left hand side. If you scroll down, you'll find preferences and what we want today is the reaction preferences. Give that a click. It's going to load up these two options right here. So the first one is to basically be able to see other people's likes and reactions on their posts. You can toggle this on, which basically means it's going to hide the number of reactions. And then there's your posts. So you can see or hide the total number of uh, likes and reactions on your posts by toggling this on. When both of these options are on, you will no longer see the P uh, likes and reactions on people's posts or on your own. So that's how you'd go ahead and do this on your um, desktop application. So let's go ahead and jump on over now to the mobile app and I'll show you how to do it there. Okay, so here we have the mobile application uh, for Facebook, right? This is just on my iPhone. And what I want to do is in the bottom right hand corner, there's a little icon that says menu. We're going to give that a click. It's going to load up this one here. I'm going to scroll down until we find the settings and privacy. We're going to give that a click. And then from here, we are going to click on settings. This is going to load up all the settings again. We're going to scroll down to where we have our preferences and we're going to find the reaction preferences. We're going to give that a click and you have the exact same two options that you would have had on the desktop, but on your mobile phone. The top one basically on posts from other people. It will basically hide the total number of likes and reactions. And the bottom option is basically for when you want to hide the reactions and the likes on your own post. OK, so again, you can toggle both these on if you want to hide it or you can have them off or one off and one on, etc. I'll leave that for you guys but ultimately guys it is as easy as that to basically hide your likes and reactions on Facebook if you found this useful and informative hit that like button for me subscribe for more hints and tips and if you haven't done so you might be really interested in that video right there so give it a click and check it out